Hey everybody, this is Rick, also known as Duke City Devil Dog. It is November 16th, it's a Saturday, 2019, and I am in Simpsonville, Kentucky. Uh, started off just uh, near Ashland, Kentucky this morning. Uh, headed west, uh, just uh, should be a really great day. Gonna try to put in my whole clock today, to see, see at least put in 10 hours, get us down the road. Hopefully we can, uh, we're scheduled to get to our drop early. Hopefully we'll get a repower, get off of it and get moving somewhere else. But uh, should be a great day. Kentucky's beautiful, what I've seen of it. Uh, been uh, riding in the, in, the, uh, in the passenger seat for the last couple hours, just checking it out, getting it to see the, see the uh, countryside. Um, been doing a lot of night driving. With, it's been getting dark, <laughs> 4 30, 5 o'clock. So I'm looking forward to today. Be uh, have quite a bit of daylight, so should be a nice day. Uh, we'll see if anything else interesting happens. Uh, but uh, uh, I will talk to you guys later on. Have a good one. Hey everybody, this is Rick, also known as Duke City Devil Dog. Just taking a break. Uh, we're about uh, about two hours. Uh, east of Kansas City, Missouri. I uh, had to stop taking my 30 minute break. Been driving just a little over seven hours, so uh, you gotta take a 30 minute break be uh, before you get to the eight hour mark. So that's what we're doing now. We're gonna drive a couple more hours and then hang it up for the night. Uh, a couple things I just wanted to share. Um, first time driving across Kentucky. Uh, been in Missouri before, but first time driving across Missouri. Uh, got to see the arch in uh, St. Louis as we passed it. Uh, it was a little bit from the distance, but got to see it. It's, it's unmistakable. Uh, unmistakable. Um, but one other thing we, we saw that was amazing is we saw a couple swarms of birds that had to be in the tens of thousands of birds. They looked like they were migrating south and that was something else to watch. Um, and the last thing is as the sun went down, we were crossing a bridge that that crosses the Missouri River and the colors that were reflected off the water, it was just beautiful. You know, one of the things in traveling, you know, <coughs> excuse me, one of the things that in traveling the country that, uh, that you have to appreciate are those kinds of things. Uh, the birds, the arch, the, the colors on the water. Even though you're paying attention and making sure you're, you're, you're driving safely and everything, you can still see those things. You can still appreciate those things. And uh, it's amazing. So, uh, like I said, got a couple more hours and we're going to hang it up for the night. So, um, I will touch base with you uh, in a little while. Have a good one. Hey everybody, this is Rick, also known as Duke City Devil Dog. I am in Kansas City, Missouri. We stopped at the Ameristar Casino just to uh, grab the buffet. They had some truck parking over here. So we came to grab the buffet. We didn't end up getting the buffet because uh, it was seafood night and they were charging like $40 for the buffet, even if you weren't going to eat the crab legs. So uh, we ended up getting something else. Uh, almost went to a concert. I wish I would have would have been here a little bit earlier. We would have got a chance to go see Mark Chestnut. Uh, big favor of him. Uh, Bubba Shot the Jukebox is one of the songs that he did that I really liked. But uh, that 80s, 90s country music really liked Mark Chestnut. But I uh, was able to hear some of it out uh, in the casino a little bit. Um, out by where we were eating, you could hear it. Um, but other than that, it was a really good night. We uh, had some fun and uh, getting some rest, gotta get some rest so we can get moving early tomorrow. Uh, there is a chance tomorrow that uh, we're gonna shut down somewhere around Fort Collins, Colorado, uh, when we look at our, our plan, which would be great because my daughter is in Fort Collins, going to Colorado State University, she's a sophomore, and uh, it would be nice to be able to see her and maybe have, uh, have a meal or something like that, that'd be great. So hopefully, with a little bit of luck, We'll get a chance to see her tomorrow and, uh, and go from there. But right now, it, uh, uh, I ate and spent about uh, 30 minutes in the casino and uh, gonna head to, uh, to go get some shut-eye. 
uh, so we can get running tomorrow. Uh, usually the way it's been going is Mark, my mentor, will drive for a couple hours to start the day. And then I'll pick up and drive my clock and then he'll drive a few hours towards the end of the day. And then we'll just go from there. So it uh, works out pretty good. Uh, today, uh, one of the things that I wanted to do is I wanted to check my stamina. And what do I mean by that? Uh, well, if you've been driving a truck or you're thinking about driving a truck, stamina is really important. Being able to drive for long periods of time without stopping is really important. So my goal was to drive at least seven hours before stopping to take a break. And I did. I drove about seven hours and 10 minutes, seven hours and 15 minutes uh, before we stopped so I could take a break. Uh, take my 30 minute break that I needed to take and then uh, and then go from there. So worked out really well. Uh, and I still had more gas in the tank, so to say, in my tank. Uh, but we decided to, uh, when looking at places we could stop and looking at at uh, available parking, everything was pretty packed. Uh, so we ran for about another hour and a half or so and then uh, stopped here uh, where they did have some uh, parking and uh, and gonna spend the night. So uh, I'm headed back to the truck, gonna get some shut eye and I uh, hope you guys have a great rest of the night. Uh, I'll talk to you tomorrow and uh, hopefully with a little bit of luck, I'll get to see my daughter tomorrow. So hope everybody has a great night. Uh, if you've been liking my my videos or you you watch them regularly, please subscribe. Uh, it uh, it's good uh, if you uh, uh, to help me out that way. I mean, I don't get anything for it other than just a little you know good feeling for me. But please subscribe uh, if you want to no be notified when I post another video, which is just about every day. Uh, go ahead and hit the bell icon. And if you like my videos, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions or there's anything or any comments, please leave them below. Uh, you can leave them on any of my videos and I will try to answer them for you the best I can. So I hope you guys have a great one and I will see you tomorrow.